I have this deep conditioner, Coil Infusion Triple Full Treat Deep Conditioner from Uidad. No cap, I don't like Uidad. I, I don't like it because the smell is too aggressive for my nose. I know it is a, a, it's a beautiful brand, people love it, it's like a million dollars. And I got it because of someone that I worked with, they gave it to me and what we don't do is waste product. Um, I don't use their shampoo at all because it is too stripping. Um, but I'm using the dip conditioner because I'm just gonna try it and see. I don't like the smell though. The smell is really, really strong. And I think for me, that's what's turning me off from this product, it, like completely. The smell is too much. I like subtle smells, but I, especially for my hair, I like fruity smells. As you can see, I try as much as possible to also get some of the conditioner in my roots just because my roots are dry. All of it is just dry. So what I'm going to do is actually comb my hair. Why am I doing this? Because now it's like in a place where it can actually, it's malleable, you feel me? I'm doing this so that I don't have to do it when it is after I wash it because I'm going to try to blow dry my hair this time around. I know, like, who does she think she is? So, do you see this? My hair is dirty and it's matted. Yeah, I cut my nails too because this is serious business. So, what I'm just gonna do here is, you see how tangled baby girl is? <sighs> Anyways, so whenever, yeah, you have to kind of um, untangle those knots one by one. You can't just, you can't just tear them. And this is a long process that I just do. You see? And I will do this until I'm able to pass the comb through it. And I'm, as you can see, I'm using a wide tooth comb because those thin, thin, the little things <laughs> will break my hair. It's getting better. The thing about doing your hair, especially girls with natural hair, especially girls with 4C hair, is patience. You have to be patient with your hair. It makes sense. I mean, you have to be patient with your hair, you have to be patient with your skin, you have to be patient with yourself, you have to be patient with everything. Just be gentle, be patient, take your time. Where, where are you running to? Where are you... But look at this. Look at all this dead hair. Do you see? A hot mess. A true hot mess. Anyways, I'm gonna take a little bit more. I'm gonna put it in my hand and I'm just gonna... And I'm gonna let it sit in my hair for a couple of hours, you know? Do you see that? I'm gonna let it sit in my hair for a couple of hours to really seep in and then I'm gonna shampoo my hair. Um, I'm trying out a new shampoo. So I don't like the Uidad shampoo. I stopped. Um, I will be using my Tea Tree Tingle shampoo from Trader Joe's, but only once a month. But like, I'm gonna try this new shampoo by um, Shea Mo Moisture. It's it's a shampoo that isn't stripping. So I can't use things that strip my hair's natural oils because my scalp dies and my hair is just crunchy for a million years. This is a little bit of a long video, so I'm gonna go on like a um time lapse you know you feel me i'm gonna do a time lapse so that you see that this is what it looks yeah guys my hair is really really dirty this is the leave-in not the um the deep conditioner anyways yeah let's do it
It's a lovely day today. Mm, 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 mm. See you guys when my hair is done. I'm not gonna film the washing process because I'm not that dedicated. No cap. I'm not there yet. And nor do I have the equipment for it. I just, I'm tired thinking about it. So maybe one day. See you guys in my next.